Hey guys, Joe Jellison here with Chat Cats Fishing. Today I'm going to show you a catfish rig that I believe to be most effective when catching big catfish. So let's go ahead and get started. As you can see here guys, I have a Carolina rig. And I believe this to be a very effective rig when catching big catfish while anchor fishing. And it's a rig that I've used for the past three years now, and it has been very reliable. Uh, I've, I haven't really missed a fish off of this rig that you see. So I believe this to be very beneficial for you. So what I have here is 50 pound monofilament fishing line, and I have a no roll sinker right here. And the no roll sinker, its purpose is to slide up and down freely on your main line. And I then have that going down to a bead with a knot. And the knot is an improved clinch knot going down to a barrel swivel. So your main line goes down to the top of the barrel swivel at the main eye. And then at the bottom of the barrel swivel, I have an 80 pound monofilament leader line and it's about I don't know 15 inches or so going down to a polymer knot to an ADOT double action team catfish circle hook and uh, my main line is 50 pounds so you can kind of see I go really heavy here guys I use 50 pound monofilament line with an 80 pound leader line especially if you're anchor fishing where you have heavy current uh, you want to go heavy so you're able to haul in the fish with that current. So another setup I use, it's pretty much the same thing. It's a Carolina rig, but instead of using the no roll sinker, I use a disc sinker, which I'm starting to kind of move to this just because it's a little more efficient while you're fishing where if you want to change your weights, you can easily do this with the disc sinker, disc sinker or even a um, bank sinker as well. So you can even put a bank sinker on here and it works just as well. So Team Catfish came out with a design where they took a dual lock snap, which is this right here. And uh, like I said, it, it works just like a no roll sinker. It moves freely up and down your main line and it goes down to this little yellow thing here which i guess is a uh a stopper or something like that and it goes down to your knot and then everything else is pretty much the same i have a barrel swivel going down to an 80 pound leader line to a eight dot double action circle hook team catfish so i believe this to be a little more efficient just because you're able to take your your sinkers out and you can put a lighter or a heavier sinker on there without really wasting any time for fishing. So if you're anchor fishing guys, I really believe this to be a very effective rig setup. It really won't work while you're drifting, but if you're anchor fishing in a spot and you have some current going by, some heavy current, um, I believe this to be probably the most effective rig you're going to be able to use because it keeps your uh, bait right on the bottom where you cast so as far as hook skies that I use uh, I typically use team catfish products this is an ADOT double action circle hook and it's a very reliable hook for me I've had only but, only but success with these hooks and you can go a little bit smaller um, you can even go to a 5 aught if you'd like to but the ADOT seems to be my favorite and you can catch catfish over 100 pounds with this hook so i've caught and fish as small as five pounds on this but if you're going to go any catfish below 20 pounds i highly suggest you use a smaller hook but if you're trying to go for the big boys 50 pounds or more this is what you want to use i'll be sure to leave a link at the bottom where you can access the team catfish website and go to their store so you can get some stuff all right, guys, that's pretty much all that I have. Um, if you have any questions related to this rig, please uh, feel free to leave a comment and like and subscribe. Thanks, guys.